Today on the CBS Public Affairs program, Face the Nation. Through the eyes of this television camera, Senator Joseph R. McCarthy, Republican of Wisconsin, with correspondents across the country questioning him. Live from Indianapolis, New York City, and also here in Washington. Here's the moderator of Face the Nation, Ted Koop. How do you do? And welcome to Face the Nation. Senator McCarthy, on the eve of this historic special session of the United States Senate, called to debate a motion to censor you, millions of Americans are wondering what it's all about. To direct their questions to you, our panel of newsmen is now assembled nearly halfway across the continent. Here in Washington are William H. Lawrence of the New York Times and William Hines, Jr. of the Washington Star. Standing by nearly 800 miles away in Indianapolis is Jep Cadu, Indiana manager of International News Service with a question of interest in the Midwest. Come in, Jep Cadu. Cadu. Senator McCarthy, several weeks ago, you predicted that the United States Senate would censor you, and several days ago, Roy Kuhn told us in Indianapolis that the cards were stacked against you. Uh, how do you feel about that now? And uh, uh, if you feel the same way, uh, why, Senator? The Democrats, I believe, will go pretty much down the line on this. Then the so-called liberal, I put liberal in quote, Republicans will go along with them. I think they've got plenty of votes to uh, do it. In fact, I was talking to one of my Democrat friends the other day. He told me very frankly he was going to vote for censure. He said, not because of the silly reasons given by the Wat Watkins Committee. He said, but because you labeled the Democrat Party as the party of communism. You issued an open invitation during the Army McCarthy hearings for people to continue to supply you with information. That's right. Regardless of its stamping. Are you getting uh, new information from people in this administration Bill, on let that me, basis? Let me change your question a bit. I invited them to give information of wrongdoing, graft, corruption, communism. I am continuing to get to that information. Getting documents, too? Yes. Mm -hmm. Are you getting any more as a result of your appeals than you got beforehand? Mm, build has there been a flow build up as a result of that? It's pretty hard to say whether it has increased or decreased. I've been so busy being investigated and preparing for this uh, uh, lynch bee starting tomorrow that I haven't had to, uh, an opportunity to... You call That's a meeting effective. of the United States Senate a lynch bee? Well, let's, call it, let's call it the... Uh, censure uh, uh, no but I'm interested meeting. in this because the Senate's an institution of government it's part of the Congress well okay, let's, let's, answer the Senate Bill. Lynch? Let's, let's answer it Bill let's do the the there are a great number of the Democrats who have indicated uh, in private conversations that they will censure McCarthy not because of what is in the Watkins report because of uh, I've labeled them as the party of communism, even though I have always pointed out that there are millions of Democrats who are good, loyal Americans, and many office holders here in Washington who are anti-communist. But there are those who feel that they should censure me, not for, not because I cross-examined Zwicker trying to find out a, about a communist whom he promoted, honorably discharged. There, there are some Republicans who feel likewise. Now, I, I consider that, uh, yes, that's, that's a lynching bee. Well, this is an orderly when, when, assembly. When they're, when they're not, when they're not, when they're not uh, basing their vote upon the uh, uh, counts set forth, when they base their vote upon political reasons, when they say ahead of time, in effect, regardless of what the evidence says, this man has been fighting communism. He's been showing that over 20 years the Democrat Party has been infiltrated. Therefore, we're going to get him. Well, now, Senator, I, th I think a lynching bee is a good name for it, Bill. Senator.